We are getting bougie today. Fast foodies, guess what? I got my taco socks on, which can only mean one thing. It's taco time! Oh, and I forgot to mention, if you want to pick up a pair of cool taco socks just like mine, then make sure to check out the description box for a special fast foodie discount. For today's taco time review, I'm going to be having some Taco Bell, but I'm not going to be enjoying taco time by myself. No, I got some friends here today. You guys want to come on? Yes, sir. Well, look who I got. I just found these guys at my local Taco Bell. Yeah, look, I got the whole game here. Today. You guys all hear them. Make sure to smash that subscribe button to see more incredibly delicious Taco Time reviews. I actually heard that Taco Bell is going to be bringing back an uh, Enchirito. I don't know what an Enchirito is, but I guess we'll find out when it comes back. But for today's Taco Time review, I'm not actually going to be having a taco. No, I'm going to be switching it up a bit and I'm going to be having some fries. Why fries? Well, because you see on the Fast Foodies, we're all about trying the newest, latest, and greatest. And Taco Bell just came out with these all new Loaded, loaded Drop Fries. Yeah. If you look at that audience participation, they are great out here. But what's interesting about these Loaded Drop Fries is that the fries aren't actually the star of the show. No, no, no. You see, the sauce is where the hype is at because the sauce is where the truff is at. You heard me, Taco Bell is serving sauce with truffles in it, black truffles to be exact. Before you know it, Burger King is gonna be coming out with gold dusted burgers. Now that would be something else. But taking a closer look at this loaded truff sauce, yes, I did pay the extra 66 cents to get a side of this sauce on its own. I'm not seeing any specks of the black truffle, which is a little bit surprising considering it's black truffle. You would assume that the black truffle would stand out in this red, fiery, spicy sauce. I truly hope it's not, uh, not too fiery, too spicy. <laughs> but I guess I shouldn't be too surprised because Taco Bell does write that the black truffle is a blended into the sauce. So I guess if we want to find out if there truly is black truffle in this black truff sauce, we just can't keep looking at it. No, we're going to have to taste it. But to make sure I don't get any of the any of the seasoning of the fries mixed in with the sauce itself, I'm actually going to grab my tasting fork. That's right. For some reason, Taco Bell doesn't have any spoons. <laughs> they have knives and forks. And since whenever I lick my knife, my dad always gets mad at me. I decided to choose a fork. But I'm actually going to use my fork, dip it in here, and try the sauce by itself first. And then we'll get into the actual loaded trough fries. On the fork look. Oh man! Oh! Guys, that is hot! That is... Oh man! Woo! That's spicy! It's oh! Spicy. Uh, oh, it's, it's very spicy. Oh, that's a little too spicy for me. Oh, maybe that's why they don't sell this normally by itself. Honestly, it's so spicy, I can't even tell if there's truffle in there or not. Oh, I'm starting to get the hiccups now. I should have brought my backup. Mm. Oh, well. Um, hopefully, it'll calm down a little. The heat will... Oh, I can't even talk. The heat will calm down a little when I try it with the fries. Oh man, have you guys tried the loaded truff fries? No, no. Oh boy, it is. It's spicy. Bruh. If you guys grab some forks, I'll let you try some. If you guys grab some forks. Oh. Oh man. I want to review this for you guys, but the sauce is so spicy. Oh. Taco Bell wasn't messing around. Yeah, if you want, actually, you can just, I is guess it you. Spicy? Uh, oh, it's spicy? It's very spicy. Uh, well, the sauce itself is spicy. I haven't actually tried the fries itself. 
Um, but yeah, I guess if you guys want to grab one. Yeah. You can dip it in the sauce if you want to try it. You guys want some? No, I don't like that. Oh, is it, oh, is it fire? 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 Like, it's it's really good. Everyone follow me on TikTok. <laughs> follow her on TikTok. Hashtag TikTok <laughs> influencer. <laughs> Hashtag lace. <laughs> Hashtag no one north underscore. No one north underscore. I'll put that up on the screen somewhere. Yes, sir. All right. Going in for the bite. We're going to grab some of the, the steak here. Oh, boy. As I was saying, if the Enchirito is supposed to be this spicy, uh, yeah, you guys may not be seeing a review of that here on the Fast Foodies. You might have to go over to some other Fast Foodie channel to see a review of that. But here you guys go. I think the sour cream will help dial down that heat. Mmm. Much better. There goes, there goes my fast foodie chilling section. <laughs> Those guys are great. They just came out of nowhere. <laughs> I think they're actually coming from a volleyball game having the Taco Bell. I remember when I was a teenager, after Friday night football games, we'd head over to there's this one uh, Mexican place, it's called uh, Los Burritos. Los Burritos, something Los Burritos, we'd always just call it Los. <laughs> but man, they had some burritos there that were truly incredible. They actually served pig tongue there. I'm pretty sure I had pig tongue once. Um, yeah, I had it once. <laughs> it was not my favorite. Have you guys ever had chicken heart? I have had chicken heart before at a Brazilian, Brazilian steakhouse. It's actually pretty tasty. Uh, but back back to these loaded truff fries. Uh, I'm happy to report that this comes with normal steak. No chicken hearts or uh, tongue in this. At least, I hope not. <laughs> Just normal steak, french fries, cheese, and that truff sauce. The fries. I mentioned at the beginning of the review that the fries weren't the star of the show. That the fries aren't actually the star of the show. But the fries are actually my favorite part. <laughs> um, a little crispy, a good amount of seasoning. And I am tasting some of the seasoning, even with the truff sauce. That tells you how strong the seasoning is. But man, this truff sauce, I paid 66 cents for it, and I'm definitely not gonna be getting my money's worth because I'm not gonna be finishing this. If I have any more of the truff sauce by myself, um, yeah, my stomach will not be happy. I'm, I already angered it quite a bit. I don't want to make it any more angry. But you get some nice, there are some tomatoes in here, so I'm getting my veggies. It's pretty much like a salad with potatoes, cheese, getting your protein source with the steak. It's a pretty, pretty healthy choice. Only 500 calories for this entire little bowl of loaded truff fries. <laughs> But I think I've had enough of these truck fries to give it a rating. I'm going to give it, um, even though they're good, I am a little disappointed. I'm going to give it a, a 6 out of 10 just because of how spicy it is. And honestly, I couldn't really taste any truffle. I think, I think it may just be a little gimmick, a little marketing ploy from Taco Bell. You know, so they can say... Look at us, we're serving truffle. But in fact, they're just serving up a super hot sauce, so hot that it makes you forget that you're actually supposed to be eating truffle, because that's kind of what happened to me. But I hope you guys enjoyed this review a little bit more than I enjoyed these truff fries. And I truly hope that the next Taco Bell review goes better than this one. I'll see you guys in the next one. If you made it to the end of this video, then I'm sure that you want to become a fast foodie as well. So all you have to do is hit that subscribe button. And to see exclusive behind the scenes footage, then you can head on over to Instagram and follow the fast foodies at Fast Foodies Review.